Hello there, this is Ahmed Gad. Welcome back to the video 255 in the Java, Eclipse, and Android series. The prerequisite for this video is to understand the preparation of the Java environment, and you can prepare your machine to Android programming and development. Uh, this uh, a link for this video how to prepare your uh, machine for Java and installing the Eclipse uh, on it also you need to have information about the project and the package classes uh, before to start this video this video will talk about the Eclipse scrapbook it's kind of testing utility uh, to test your code and statement uh, within your project without affecting anything in an easy way so let's start we have create a project we create a project and create a package inside the project then we create a class car for that reason I'm saying that you need to be uh, well understanding the uh, creation of a project and the creation of a class inside a package in this package we have uh, some fields in this class we have some fields that it's uh, integer letters and uh, private string class and it's already defined here and public uh, string brand and manufacturer uh, and also we create three constructors uh, the first constructor is identifying no parameters and it just uh, declares the uh, li letters so if you need to use this one you need to give no parameters and just the three uh, uh, the two other parameter would be um, identified so let's first play with creating the scrapbooks and start testing this code so creating a scrap just on the package and go to new uh, start others and go to the debugging for java running run and debug and start create a scrap give it a name for example training one then finish an empty space empty page will appear the first thing you need to know right now is that you have these five icons and only these five icons you will play with this uh, scrap page or scrap uh, book so first of all we need to clarify something to include to import a package to be um, evaluated in this area so start to add a package and start to get your class trainer package okay and say okay and that's all without this package you may find a problem in evaluation I'll show you some of these problems without including the package you may have some problems in evaluation like cannot be resolved the values so you must include the package and say okay uh, now we will write certain codes to start to test so we can start to make a new object a new instant from the class car so we say car okay uh, car a equal new car without any parameters and right now we need to evaluate the car A but before evaluating the car A you know that the process the class for car A needs to be clear just a moment to clear some of the letters so you need to have two strings 
to evaluate the car A so we need to dot car A dot the brand and say the brand will be A B C and we need to evaluate also I mean to initialize the manufacturer and it will be for example Mazda okay and right now we will have car A so right now if you start to evaluate and inspect and inspect the result and evaluate the selected text so you will have a syntax error because and this is what we are saying right now that when you have an error you can imagine this is like a diagnostic or a debugging way to run your code so we have we really have an error we need to check what's error inside so we expect it to have equal sign here okay right now let's start again to evaluate the error evaluating the uh, sorry evaluating the car a so we select the text and start for that we have no error right now and we have a new window that evaluates that the brand of this car it's okay you did initialize it to APC and the class of this car already is initialized in the main class in the main class to A and the liter is 1500 uh, and the manufacturer is Mazda and we right now create a real object or a real instant from the main uh, car class so this is good way to work with it and also you can run uh, execution so this is for evaluating we have here in the scrap scrapbook give you evaluation for the expressions and give you execution for the statement uh, don't uh, be confused between those but uh, it's actually the result here we did execute the expression and this expression got no error so let's add some errors to this expression and uh, start to execute it again you will have syntax error stuff like this so and the syntax error in the token brand okay so you it's it's just monitor you and point you to the error where is the error the scrap is very useful so let's go right now here in another scrap file we can pick this one and go to the training one and add it so you can have as much as you have uh, as you could from scrap files here we have three scrap files okay three stra scrap files so let's evaluate this is it okay uh, it's okay we have no error we have no error top is it okay to uh, estimate or or evaluate or inspect the element a element a is a is a new object created or a new instant created from the car class uh, let's let's check it it's okay because in element a you have this is another con uh, constructor we have three constructors one without parameters and one with just one parameter let's see it one without parameters and one with two parameters manufacturer and brand and one with just the manufacturer and the other parameters are defined inside like the brand is coded by Mazda and the manufacturer will be substituted from the manufacturer so these are the three classes we have so let's evaluate this one I use the con I mean these are the three constructor I'm sorry for that this is the three constructor for from the class so we are trying now to evaluate the constructor number two with two strings so let's go and evaluate it it cannot be resolved uh, why not 
it's resolved why why here it cannot be resolved this is an important issue this is an important issue because as I told you this one we did play in the class add a package inside it this is scrapbook we add a package inside but this scrapbook I don't know is there is a package or not for that reason if there is no a package for the scrapbook so you will not start the evaluation and it will give you car cannot be resolved he don't know what about the car what's the car class okay so that's uh, a very important issue in the scrap files it's very useful utility um, maybe my example is very small but you can um, understand if you a programmer already have the concepts of, of programming in this area you will use it as one of your first and most um, point to de declare this uh, the program errors actually uh, also if you start here you may want to say a dot you will see here that the brand and the manufacturer are appear because these are yes you are right these are public uh, public fields so it's okay to be but the other two fields the letters and the brand is not appear right here so you can for this uh, you will start to solve your problem if you want to do it if you want by adding some getters and some setters okay so by this if I do so I add a getter and a setter okay continue sometime uh, by the way wh why this happened uh, do you notice that I, I told you that's five uh, icons what is this icon this is the stop the evaluation so we can play with the class the main class without this you will have this message uh, don't care about it but if if it appear you know what you do is uh, the class must be saved after any changes and go to the training and start right now I will add a dot in this we will have <coughs> the brand and the manufacturer and one of our private fields is not displayed but you can add the get letter so ha this is a way to start using your private fields and this is a very important point in getter and setter so it's not protected like uh, right now I was classifying in a certain uh, protected uh, CC for these cars so now it's not protected and you can type what I would say 300 3000 it will accept this or not that's what I'm saying well, ha, ha, it will accept it or not see let's see and let's start to execute is any problem with the execution uh, the left hand side of an assignment must be a variable so let's go to the main the car let's check getter ah how come <laughs> this is a very this is a mistake I want to set I not want to get I want to set right now sorry for that we need now to set the letter okay let's go again to car get and set letter so that's okay save it let's start to set letter here a dot set letter here why it didn't appear before I don't know to what to what 
to for example like this let's evaluate see what I'm doing right now I'm evaluating in a quick way that's what I'm saying I'm debugging in a quick way that I'm doing right now I'm debugging I'm evaluating in a very quick way uh, expect something in okay let's execute we have no problem to execute let's say what is the value of the A right now so let's inspect it's okay that is the Toyota with the class A with the manufacturer Carlos whatever we did inside this yeah yeah it's Carlos that I, I write it and here we are we start to modify the private and not the private again I say the private field I'm modifying the private field because I make a setter and a getter for it okay that all about the scrapbook it's uh, video number 255 and um, as you see you need a prerequisite to start this, this is maybe advanced in uh, Java uh, it's not starting from scratch it's starting from uh, starting you have a concept for the classes packages and rows and, and, and projects and fields and private and public fields and stuff like this constructors so you need to have uh, good knowledge to start this and this video is helping you again I, I like to uh, summarize it's helping you to evaluate expressions and values uh, in a quick way inside your uh, Java project thank you for listening this is Ahmed Gad and please uh, see other videos up in the series of Java Eclipse and Android uh, video series. Thank you for watching.